Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. If you're new here, I'm Jalissa. So today I'm trying out some pretty exciting hair tools. Like, I am so excited. I got sent in the mail these two items. Oh my God. Thank you so much to Panasonic for collaborating with me in today's video wow so panasonic reached out to me for this collaboration and they actually want me to do a video just kind of like trying out these two hair tools and i'll be honest with you guys i didn't even know that panasonic had hair tools like this is from panasonic beauty and today i am finally going to use a blow dryer it's been maybe like four months since i've used a blow dryer to blow out my hair you guys already know i'm obsessed with my revlon one step hair dryer and volumizer and i use it all the time but i mean why not try out a blow dryer today this is so cool because it brings three different attachments it brings a quick dry nozzle attachment it also brings the concentrator one and the diffuser so it brings a diffuser so if you need a diffuser to curl your hair this brings it already so that is pretty cool anyways this retails for a hundred dollars okay so i do feel like it is a little bit pricey but i mean if it's good quality if it's good if it's nice then it can probably be worth it you know it's probably worth it so we're gonna see if it's worth it the money okay and i'm gonna be completely honest with you guys you guys already know then they also sent me this flat iron which looks so cool i haven't opened any of these yet by the way this retails for 129 dollars so 130 dollars anyways let's open this up i am super excited how many times have i said that i'm excited already probably like 20 times but <laughs> this feels like christmas i love unboxing stuff but anyways oh my god this is interesting this is interesting looking what this is cool oh my god these look like speakers anyways i am going to attach this on the concentrator i use my living proof restore perfecting spray i already sprayed some of that on my hair so i'm not going to add any more because then it could get a little bit sticky and we don't want that but if you guys are wondering this is what i use before i blow out my hair and i feel like it helps so much with making my hair look smooth nice shiny you already know so i forgot to tell you guys but this is removable the filter so it's pretty cool because that way it's easier to clean if you want to clean it i'm using this round brush from conair i'm not the biggest fan of this brush i probably should have used another one because this one is a little bit harsh but we're still gonna do it and i'm excited i haven't done this in a while let's see okay hi Okay, so here's what my hair is looking like. I can probably get it a little bit smoother, but I just wanted to show you guys quickly what it's looking like so far. This brush is very small. I probably should have tried it with another bigger brush. Like, I am used to the Revlon brush, which is like the size of my face. It is so big. So it's going to take me probably longer to blow out my hair with this small one. But I'm going to time it now and I'm going to tell you guys how long it takes me to blow out my hair and I'll be right back. So here's what the first side looks like. You know, I've obviously have had better blowouts. I'm not going to lie. I will say this side took me about 23 minutes to blow out my hair. So to me, that's not bad, but I usually will do it in like 15 minutes with my Revlon one step hair dryer and volumizer so it did take me a little bit longer probably like eight minutes more and I feel like it looks a little bit more like poofy 
but it's not bad i mean i honestly really do think that this brush is not helping me at all i probably should have used another brush and this is actually the only brush that i have here at home i noticed that big brushes just work a lot better for me i, I think i got used to them a lot more so this one this little brush of course is going to take you longer to blot your hair with this tiny brush so i'm not a big fan of this brush i mean this isn't even from the same brand i mean i just got this at cvs but if i were to do this again i would probably use a bigger brush and a nicer brush but anyways i'm gonna finish my hair and i'll be right back with the final blown out look <laughs> okay so this is as good as it's gonna get it's been about 50 minutes almost like 48 minutes so overall my thoughts about this blow dryer i like it i really do like it but i've had other tools that have blown out my hair a lot quicker so unfortunately that's like the only thing that i'm like mm, i don't know like when it compared to other tools that i have i feel like it could really blow out your hair really nicely but i do need more practice using this but now we're gonna try out the straightener that is something that i am very excited about um so this is a straightener it retails for about 130 dollars so i guess we're gonna see how this works it heats up in 30 seconds so actually let's time that and see if it heats up in 30 seconds so it goes from 270 degrees fahrenheit to 395 degrees fahrenheit so it gets pretty hot so it says that it boosts shine that i am very interested in seeing if that is actually true it increases moisture huh i'm supposed to get more shine more smoothness and more moisture let's see if that is true let's open this up this is what the straightener looks like wow i love how it looks okay so i have my timer ready let's turn this on and see if it actually takes 30 seconds to warm up so okay i started right now it is blinking i don't know if you can see that it also has a swivel cord so that's pretty interesting and i love that okay so 30 seconds it's still blinking okay now it stopped okay so yeah it took about 35 seconds what is that sound? That is scaring me though. Do you guys hear that? I do have to say though, my hair feels very, very soft. Um, I just wish it looked a little bit smoother, you know? So let's see if the straightener can help a little bit with that. So we're going to start at 270. Let's see if I can get it completely straight with one pass. I mean, my hair is pretty much straight, but it is a little bit, like, poofy. So, we should be able to see a difference. Um, so, let's try this. Okay. okay not bad okay so it is pretty straight let's do another pass because i want it to be more straight okay so it looks pretty straight i'm liking it so far let's do another pass the temperature is at the lowest heat so you know it's gonna take a little bit longer to get it more straight but but so far it's looking nice this this noise is just really bothering me like i feel like it's gonna like explode or something do you hear that it's like really scary but anyways let's go up to 315 okay okay so that made it very straight i am liking the 315 yeah i'm liking the 315 a lot and it doesn't pull your hair at all i'm really liking the straightener it's actually really really nice well, this is a one inch straightener so something else that you can do with this straightener is actually curl your hair so let's do a little curl just to see what the curls turn out like so i'm just gonna go like this and flip the flat iron 
pull it down and it's not even pulling my hair so that's pretty interesting i like that it's not pulling my hair and ooh, there you have it a little curl that's beautiful i like that and it has shine too you see that yeah i like that but i'm just gonna get it straight for today I'm doing a straight look you already know <laughs> straight and sleek i'm really feeling the straightener i'm totally gonna use this again like totally gonna use this again okay 3.95 let's do this Ooh, you see the steam though whoa wow but it left my hair so straight wow look at that look at that shine look at that shine my hair is turning out so nice with the straightener i'm like in love and i will definitely use this again and again and again okay guys so here's what this side is looking like i mean look at that shine like i say that a lot i say look at that shine a lot but the shine to me is just like so important but it looks so nice and smooth like wow i feel like this straightener is like worth every single penny like i really really like this all right guys so finally here's the final look thank you so much to panasonic for sending me these goodies like it felt like christmas today like wow thank you so much overall i'm not the biggest fan of this i'm just not the biggest fan of blowing out my hair in general i'll be honest it did leave a lot of shine in my hair and i really like that about this blow dryer i just need to practice a little bit more because i feel like if i use a bigger brush it will come out even nicer but the flat iron on the other side wow i really really like this this is like probably my favorite flat iron that i have right now and i will use this so much this is really nice for straightening your hair and also curling your hair because it's a one inch so you can do curls with this as well and the curls come out really really nice i love the straightener i feel like it really left my hair looking very very healthy and super straight and super sleek like i am a big fan of this and i think this is worth every single penny so if you guys are interested in purchasing any of these products i will link them down below so make sure you go ahead and check out the description box down below okay guys that is it for today's video i hope you guys liked it if you did make sure you give it a big thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time i upload a video also when we hit 10,000 subscribers i will be doing an insane giveaway so stay tuned and subscribe if you haven't already i would really really appreciate that if you liked this video then i'm sure you're gonna like these videos as well so make sure you go ahead and check out those videos bye guys love you